Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Bobby G here, along with the lovely Mrs. G. Uh, this morning, we are outside of Gracie's Cup. It's a coffee shop here in Fort Mojave that's been recommended to us many times. So we're gonna come in here and check it out. And I believe this place is a nonprofit and uh, all the money they raise goes to cancer or something like that. Uh, it's supposed to be a, do a lot of good for the community. We'll check this out and then we will uh, give you our thoughts afterwards. Bye. All right, I'm ready for some coffee. Yes. All right. Tracy got a looks like a breakfast bagel. What is in this, Tracy? Let's see. It's sour or um, cream cheese, avocado, tomatoes, O'Brien potatoes, scrambled eggs, bacon, and cheese. Like everything on yeah. a bagel. Looks pretty amazing. It certainly does. And I got the good old standby sausage croissant breakfast sandwich. Both of them look amazing. We're going to be trying that right now we'll let you know what we think tracy just got a black coffee and i got a salted caramel it looks amazing i've never seen a breakfast sandwich quite like that before. me neither and i am dying to try it mm. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. that's a big bite it is i'm gonna have to sorry that's sorry. a breakfast sandwich yeah Big bite. Oh yeah, that's good. There's cheese on the bottom and it's nice and crispy and then with the cream cheese on the top and the tomato and the potatoes and the avocado, it's just really tasty. Nice. Really tasty. Nice, nice little breakfast spot. It is. And here's Bobby G with his beautiful croissant, egg, and sausage cheese. And tell us what you think, my dear. Well, I'll tell you, for starters, it sure looks a lot better than uh, what you find at the fast food places. Uh, it's like cheddar cheese, sausage, egg in there. We'll give this a little try. That's really good. Um, very nice, tasty sausage egg good cheddar cheese in there you know it's a breakfast croissant but it's mm -hmm. delicious um i really like it the croissant though is is a true croissant it's not one of them fast food breakfast <laughs> processed croissants okay i also got a salted caramel cafe blend i guess it's like a frappuccino it's a frozen coffee oh okay now that's really good. Sort of like a caramel shake. It's frozen. Um, very tasty. I like it. What are you thinking of that breakfast? Set? I can't even hardly call that a sandwich. It's a bagel breakfast delight. Right. Bagel breakfast delight. That's like a plate full of goodness. 
It is. It is absolutely amazing. Mm. All right, Mrs. G got herself a blueberry muffin, which they make in-house. Um, so she's going to go ahead and give that a shot after that amazing breakfast sandwich she just had. This is warm, and I can smell the good muffinness. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. Served warm, huh? Yep. Very, very nice. Good. Beautiful. It's beautiful. That's a beautiful muffin. Oh, yeah. Loaded nice. with blueberries. Make sure each one has 47 blueberries. Yeah. An equal amount of blueberries in each muffin. You know how long that's going to take? I don't care how long it takes. Put an equal amount in each muffin. <laughs> <laughs> Just looks amazing. Yep. That looks really good. Very nice. That is a wonderful blueberry muffin. Nice. All right, guys, we are inside of Gracie's Cup, and here is the lovely Miss Gracie, who uh, runs this fine establishment. We just had uh, a couple of their sandwiches, some coffees, and uh, also one of their English or, uh, English muffins, also one of the blueberry muffins, and everything was delicious. And from what I understand, uh, Gracie's Cup actually does a lot for charity in the community, and right here is Miss Gracie, so she's going to tell us a little bit about the place. Thank you. Uh, we appreciate the time to tell you a little bit about us. Uh, we started out to be uh, a 100% nonprofit organization, and due to uh, changes in, in the hierarchy and what have you, we ended up becoming a... Uh, for-profit business. However, we do not stop donating. We are very active with the Guardian Foundation of Bullhead City and we contribute to We Care Cancer Support as well. We carry uh, the monthly meeting, uh, third Thursday of the month here at Gracie's Cup. Matter of fact, we're going to have a monthly meeting here to uh, for cancer support. Uh, a lot of the things that we do, hi Brooke, how are you? Um, is to help in the community. That's a a lot of the things that we have in here, are, we're an eclectic version. Uh -huh. I think a lot of the uh, vendors that to have their things, they put them in here. We don't charge them to put their stuff in here. However, we do ask that once they've sold something, that we leave it up to them to decide whether or not they want uh -huh. to donate and how much. But cool. we ask that they donate to one of the two charities. And sometimes they both donate to both. So and I've been looking around. You have some amazing stuff in here. Yes. Some yes, really some cool stuff. Very talented artists. Yeah, and definitely. It gives them an opportunity to display their stuff. And it also uh, adds to my story Good because boy. when people come to uh -huh. eat, they have something to look at. Wonderful uh -huh. opportunities for gifts and things like that. As All right. Well. And can you take just a minute and tell me a little bit about your, uh, like your coffees or your drinks okay. and the pastries and stuff sure. that you do? Sure. Our coffee, um, our house coffee comes from Maui. It's from uh -huh. Maui Coffee Roasters, and it's a special blend of beans that was designed for the cup, it and uh, it's a. Um, a blend so that you have all the aroma bouquet and flavor of coffee without the bitterness and the acidic yeah very smooth and tasty yeah yeah but then we can do anything else that anybody else does we can uh -huh. make it keto sugar-free whatever we can do that cool. too so right. uh, we also have boar's head meat that we serve as sandwiches because uh -huh. they have the least amount of nitrates it's a very good quality meat and because we do cater to cancer survivors we want to give them as much of a clean eating as possible so that's when we bake, our sugar-free um, items are used with monk fruit, 100% monk fruit, hmm. versus a xylitrol or an imitation sweetener. Um, we also use the finer flours, everything that we can to be good and healthy for our people. Okay. Right? And then, so that's that comes from feeding the mind, body, and soul. Awesome, awesome. Yeah, it sounds like you're well loved in the community. Um, and then a little bit about your, your pastries that you yes. make here. We make this uh, pineapple upside down. Okay, it depends. To be honest with you, I'm kind of, it's I'm selfish. I just, whatever I feel like baking at the time oh. is what I kind of do. Okay. We do always have muffins. We always have uh, croissants because our sandwiches are on croissants along with uh, the bagels. I don't make the bagels because I cannot mask them. <laughs> but Understood. I have a wonderful baker that does that for me. Okay. Um, sweet rolls, the cinnamon rolls. 
the keto um, sugar-free items all done here. Okay. And awesome. Well, thank you very much, and we've really enjoyed everything that we've had thank here you for today. Coming. We appreciate and, the opportunity. Uh, we will we'll definitely be back, and hopefully, we can get a little more community support coming in here for Wonderful. you. Wonderful. And can I just point out this is this is Brooke Nelson. Oh, hi, hi Brooke you, Nelson. How are you doing today? Our cancer support meeting. Oh, yes. Okay. She's also a two-time cancer survivor yes. okay. and an inspiration. Well, we love her theater. All so right. Appreciate her facility. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so yep. much. And we're definitely going to highlight the charities that, that uh, oh, it's get support through here. It's beautiful so. here. Awesome. All right. Well, thank you for the introduction. Thank you. And we will see you next time. Looking forward to it. Oops. Here we are outside of Gracie's Cup here in Fort Mojave. A little construction going on in the background, so pardon the noise. Uh, we just got done having some coffee, some breakfast, and uh, a pastry in there. What do you think, Miss Tracy? I think it's amazing, and I definitely want to come back and have that bagel breakfast delight again. Yeah, that was like an omelet on a bagel. Oh I've never God. seen something like that. So good. Avocado, eggs, bell pepper. Oh, that, yeah. I tasted it. It was delicious. So good. Yeah. Coffee was great. Muffin was great. Yeah. I had a breakfast croissant uh, with sausage and egg, which real cheddar cheese. Uh, and it was a real croissant, not like one of them ones you get out of fat fast food place but you know this is a, a local joint here uh, but they they do a lot to support uh, different charities cancer related things do a lot of good in the community um, and I would much rather put my money into a business like this than a big chain a chain that, that uh, starts with an S and ends in bucks or one of them places I know they got a lot of fans but you know these guys do a lot of good in the neighborhood so all right Nice stereo on that bike back there. You can hear Very that. Very nice. <laughs> so, but uh, they do a lot of good in the uh, in the community, and uh, they're located over here on the corner of Hammer and Highway 95, sort of across the street from the the Walmart. Gracie, Grace, I guess Gracie, she was just super friendly, really accommodating. Oh, very nice. Yeah, very welcoming. Told us all about the charities and, and what she's doing. Um, we highly would recommend this place, not only for the great food and, and good coffee, but uh, where your profits go to. And there's also a lot of artists that display their, their stuff in there. And uh, I guess a portion of all those sales go towards their charities as well. So pretty incredible. Uh, Fort Mojave, across the street from the Walmart. I would highly recommend you come here. My yep. breakfast was delicious. Yep. So I, on this one, I guess we have to do two thumbs, thumbs up. up. Woo! It's the G-Spot. Give these guys a shot. I'm sure you'll love it. Bye.